What up, what up, what up? Undiscovered taste buds, beard bros. How's it going, guys? All right, man, remember to like, subscribe, comment on this video. Today we are doing a one part of two part series on this channel, so wait till the end for a teaser. Um, but we are at Chili's right now, um, waiting for our food to come to the door. Uh, once we get that, we'll go back to the house and we'll show you what we got. Remember, shout out to our sponsor, Clean House Sports Picks. Uh, link in description. Hit them up, man. See if they can help you out this weekend with some picks. Um, yeah, come get hungry with us. It's not a game, it's a red skin. What up guys, just made it back to the Spizot. We're about to throw down. So we did the two for 25 um, after taxes and all. It was about 33 bucks at Chili's. We got two entrees, one side, which was a French fries, and then the, the bacon burger. And then there was a Cajun chicken pasta. And then you got to pick an appetizer, which we went with the uh, fresh guacamole. And they gave us this big ass bag of chips. That was kind of clutch. That I ain't going to lie. Yeah, that's just sick. And then they gave us some salsa. Mm -hmm. Also, they gave us a dessert. Well, obviously, we'll leave that for last. So uh, let's just try these chips and, and walk in salsa. Let's see how the salsa is. Chips are kind of thin. Yeah. Like, almost too thin. Obviously, you know what you get with your appetizers. Pretty clutch. Pretty delicious. Like I said, I'm not the biggest fan of these chips. No, they just keep breaking on me. Well, it is what it is. All right. We split this burger in half. It's got bacon. It's got lettuce, it's got tomato, it's got pickles, it's got cheese. Um, can't tell if that's like mayo, I'd assume. Um, I ain't gonna lie, it looks pretty fat. A little pinkish? A little pink. Alright. It's not a bad burger. The bread's like really squishy. Mm hmm. It's kind of not appealing to me. Not bad. I mean, was it my favorite burger? No. No. But, I don't know, for 15 bucks pretty much. So we get a half a thing of garlic bread, which I'm a big fan of garlic bread. That's pretty good. Yeah, was then you got some Cajun pasta. I don't know how to pronounce it. I think it's panini or panay. Panay pasta. 
The seasoning on chicken isn't that, like, um, it doesn't stand out. No, I don't. It tastes like a lot of pasta. And even the pasta kind of, like, lacks some sauce. Mm -hmm. I don't know if there's, there's a little bit of sauce on here, but. It's not bad, but it's like it's just not got flavor. Yeah, that's what it is. It could. I mean, for fifteen dollars, it's worth your buck. Is it? You would pay fifteen dollars for this pasta. Mm, maybe. I'll be honest. I might. I'd pay under ten dollars for this pasta right now. It's not that bad. I'm not saying it's nasty. It doesn't have a nasty taste. It doesn't have enough taste. It just, exactly. It just. I have to. But I'd, I'd pay more for that burger than I would for the pasta. Make sense? Ugh. Because you gotta think, we did go pick this up and drive home. That's true. So, it's like, you gotta give that 15, 20 minute drive home. And by the time we set up. This is this is an excusable for flavor. That's excusable for the bread. That's true. You see, because that sat there for 15, 20 minutes by the time we ate it. If you got that right off the out the kitchen, I feel like that would have been okay. But this, fresh or not fresh, I don't think this would have mattered. Because it is what it is. I don't know that Sprite's... Kind of killing it right now, though. Like, <laughs> <laughs> this tea's killing it. Shout out, Coke. Shout out, Coke. Um, I'm really trying here. Like, I keep bi taking bites because I want it. Like, I want to say it's good? It's not bad. Would I eat it? Yeah, if it was, last like, $7. <laughs> oh, okay. Like, if it was 7 bucks, I'd pay 7 bucks for this pasta. That burger... If it was, if the, if you told me that burger was 15 bucks, basically, I think that's a little high. Well, but again, burgers are kind of high. But that's what I'm saying. If I had that burger out the oven or out the kitchen, straight out the kitchen, I was sitting and dining in, I'd be okay with paying $15 for that. If you brought this out of the kitchen and it was this, I'd be back. pissed. You don't I'd be, yeah, go give me that burger. <laughs> <laughs> That's just the way yeah, I see it. I'd rather it. take this over that little pee. That, that was it. This was good. This was fresh guacamole. Yeah, that. It, it had potential. It had potential. If they sauced it up a little bit more and added something to I that cajun. I feel like cajun. if you dined in and ate it, they'd sauce it up more. I feel like they'd like... Maybe. I never ate it before, but... It yeah. had good flavor for the what the flavor was on there. Yeah, it wasn't bad. Like but I said. More of it would have been... Yeah. Really All right. Bad. Well, let's jump right into dessert. So this is called a paradise pie. Um, not sure what the pie is exactly made of. Oh, except the stuff that we put on top. All except they, it looked like some type of, I wouldn't even say that's vanilla ice cream, would you? Because it's kind of... It looks I like orange. It. Yeah. And then they gave us caramel, or caramel, however you pronounce caramel. it. And uh, some chocolate fudge. And then I believe those are pecans. I'm gonna assume maybe yeah, so, pecans. That's what. It's and it looks like there's nuts in the actual pie itself. Unless that's chocolate. No. Well, maybe I don't know. Try to get a, a little bit of everything. I'm not sure if it's a chili's thing. I'm gonna be honest. But again. Even with all the ingredients, I feel like it doesn't have a lot of flavor. Uh, it just tastes uh, the bread and obviously the chocolate and shit. But I don't know what the heck is that middle piece. I don't know what that is. So if you know, somebody tell me. I don't know what that is. It's like bread or... I don't think it's cheesecake. Mm -mm. They had cheesecake. I don't know what the fuck that is. Um... Very chewy. Oh. Very chewy. Almost has like a cookie dough mm. consistency to it, almost. That's a little commercial. Um, again, not bad. It's just for as much as you would think is going on. 
it's like not enough flavor. Yeah, for about we're gonna put about three dollars on this due to the fact those are probably around the Yeah. That would be three dollars for it. It's just not enough flavor or la- I don't know what it is. It's called Paradise Pie, but I can't tell you what it is. The best I would say it's like cookie dough. I think that's what it is. Again, it's not bad. No. I'd say the chips and wok and this also are my favorite. <laughs> the appetizer was my favorite. They have multiple of entrees. I mean, from sirloin steak to ribs to uh, other Salads. chicken. Salad. Crispers, they had all kinds of stuff. They had a lot of stuff. We wanted to go with this, try it out. Figured a burger and some pasta. See how the two... And then they, it also came with two drinks. That, so all together we got two drinks, the two entrees, the chips and salsa, and a dessert for 33 bucks. So if you divide that evenly, how much do you think the chips were? Like five bucks? Five. And then this is like three bucks? Yeah. So that's 25 bucks... So twelve fifty? Would you pay twelve fifty for the burger? Twelve fifty for the burger, not twelve fifty for the pasta. Yeah. I mean, <clears throat> there you guys go. I mean, that's Chili's. Two for two oh. for twenty five, and technically twenty three or thirty three. Down New Mexico taxes. <laughs> and if you get like a a sirloin with certain stuff, I mean. You add money to it because it's got like a two fifty dollars. Oh, you charge. just like add like this instead that, of like broccoli, you get like mashed potatoes. It would be a little extra. So, um, ah, good to know. I mean, that's know. our kind of our review of chilies today. Is I didn't like the chips; they were a little thin. Super but thin. I, I like their salsa and guacamole. Yeah, that was that was the upside. Of Pasta the had no flavor. It had no flavor yet. No. And the burger, again, I I, I, I like the burger if I would have got it straight out of the kitchen. It was a little soggy, but it had been sitting in the car for about 15, 20 minutes by the time we got home and set up. So, in all fairness, the burger, it gets a pass for me. Yeah, the burger was cool. It's a, it's a safe bet whenever you eat somewhere. A burger or yeah. chicken. I mean, it's just, it's a stack burger. It, it's fat. It is a fat burger. So I, I had it like this. I have little hands. So, so you know, it's kind of. And big. this, I'm disappointed. It looked good. It looked very good, it but looked, it was missing something. The 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 concoctions were not the right mix. I don't know that breaded gelatin shit that's in there. Uh, I don't know. But. It threw me off. Well, there's our Chili's review. If you guys oh. like Chili's, hats off to you guys. Uh-huh. So make sure to like, subscribe, share. Uh, really does help our channel grow. Appreciate everybody that has been following up with us. Um, we're just going to keep pushing out this content. Yes. So yes. shout out Clean House Sports Picks. Again, if you need help with your sports pick, they professionally give you advice weekly monthly yearly subscriptions go check them out link is in description um till next time with undiscovered taste buds and the beard bros come get hungry with us again peace laters it's not a game it's a red stick